So what do you want to do for date night? I don't know. What do you want to do? We want to play some video games? Sure, why not? What's going on, my friends? Happy Monday, Sky by Five Nights. Takes a way back later, like a rope. I'll come back and go. Yeah, later. And, and there's a festival on you. Yeah, there's a festival on you. Oh right, yeah, I'm here. Fuck you. Semi strangling, bludgeoning, crackling, hanging. Blah, 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 blah. I thought it was true. It's violence, it but is. okay. Right. You must kill someone if you want to leave. It's as simple as that. <laughs> the rest is up to you. Give it our all to achieve the best outcome in the worst way possible. She looks that down my screen. Miss Kelsey, my name is Bleach. If you didn't hear those words, my blood would be cold. That means you die. Foo I bet that got your brain juices flowing. Beats the heck out of a human catching a salmon, huh? What? I, I don't He's get a it. Bear. Uh, oh, oh, fuck. That makes sense. Like I said before, you guys are the hope of the world, but you know, taking that hope and seeing it get murdered creates a darkened shadow of despair. And just, yeah, and I just find that so darn exciting! Damn. Chaos and <laughs> What's that damn for there, bro? What the hell are you talking about? To kill each other, it's, it's... To kill each other is to kill each other. I'm sure there's a dictionary here somewhere if you need it. Wow. Jesus. Do you know what it means? It's not the problem. Why do you have to kill each other? Yeah, stop blabbering all this nonsense! Just let us go home already! Blabbering? I, I just repeated it. Blabbering? Blabbering? What do you mean blabbering? Stop blabbering! <laughs> about blabbering <laughs> you guys just don't get it, do you? Let us go, let us go! You keep on saying the same thing over and over and over and over and over. Listen, from this moment on, this school is your home, your life, your world, got it? And you can kill each other as much as, eh, as, much as you want to kill. So go ahead, go on a kill, kill, killing spree. Come on, bro. How long do you need to keep this up? Eh? No. You got us, okay? Just get the hell out of us. You can go ahead and reveal the trick now. Reveal the trick? Yeah, bro, I'm trying to go to Sandy's booth. You know, this is all some kind of trick, right? So, like, uh, Dude, shut the hell up and get out of my way. Chevy here said, Man, you face the better man, Kuma. His voice is Mondo rumbling Mondo. like the news. Listen up, asshole. This shit's gone way too far. What the hell kind of joke is this? A pretty damn funny one. Joke? What do you mean? Uh, what? You mean like oh! your hair? Oh! I like how the sound capture just went nuts. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Sick burns, bro! I'm on the road out and it's sudden boom! It sounded pro boys if you kicked off and launched yourself into the air. Jesus Christ. You flew with Monokuma fast and straight as a bullet. I thought it said butthole. I don't know why I thought that. It's called a Freudian slip. You lack on you as fast as a butthole. <laughs> You little piece of shit. I don't know if you're a toy or a stuffed animal or whatever the hell. Either way, I'm gonna rip you to fucking shreds. Jesus Christ. The violence against the headmaster is in violation of school regulations. Shut the fuck Jesus. up. Jesus. Let me out of here, I swear to Christ. This guy does not have any censor. For shame on your parents. What? No spark. Come back this time? Rebooting. Stop that goddamn beeping and say something. Watch out. Watch out. Get rid of it. Huh? huh? Hurry up and throw it. I don't know who for us and he stunned him and sent into it. Without a word, he did what he was told. He threw Monokuma. And as soon as he did. Kabumi! <laughs> the hill! That sure shit wasn't a joke, it blew me Bastard! <laughs> yep, oh wow, I just gave him a protest voice. He was a pig believing in my ears and I could feel gunpowder. Explosion might happen all the time in movies or whatever, but why did you do that? I've never seen anything like it. But you know, this means the teddy bear has been destroyed, right? <laughs> oh. I told you, I'm not a teddy bear, I'm Monokuma! Ugh! There's another one! Damn you! You so 
son of a bitch. You seriously tried to kill me just now. Well, yes, I was serious about trying to kill you. You did violate one of the school regulations, after all. Sting! I let you off with a warning this time, but you'd better be careful from now on, young man. Any naughty boy or girl who violates my rules won't get off with just a little swat on the butt. This is bad. Or a dick in their butt. Either way! Uh, hey, so this means we're like a bunch more of you around here? Yep. Monokuma must have been placed all throughout the school, yes. Plus, don't forget the surveillance cameras installed everywhere. And if you're caught breaking any rules, well, you all just saw what happened, right? <laughs> and I won't be so forgiving with my punishment next time, so don't let it happen again. Punishment, that's like just wrong. Well. Now then, lastly, to commemorate your joyous entry into our school, I have a little something for you. This is our official student handbook. Pretty cool, huh? As you see, it's fully digital, so naturally we call it the e-handbook. Ah! Hmm. Yes, well, moving on. This handbook is absolutely vital to a healthy school life, so don't lose it. When you start it up, it will display your name. Always make sure you have the right one. Hmm. Now, this is not your everyday notebook. It has a many more uses to it. Also, it's completely waterproof. Splash it, wash it, drown it, it'll keep on ticking. And thanks to the Space Age design, it can withstand an impact force of up to 10 tons. Very resistant. It contains all of our school regulations, so make sure you review them thoroughly. You'll hear me say this a lot, but any violation of school regulations will not be tolerated. <laughs> Rules restrict, yes. But they also protect. Society, for example, would be utter chaos without laws. Indeed. And the same thing applies here, which, yeah, which is why it's crucial that we you have to punish. kill each other so you can go home. Okay, well, that brings our entrance ceremony to a close. Please enjoy your abundantly dreary school life, and see ya! Later, cunts! And with that, he's done, leaving us all in the stage shot. So, guys, how should we define what we just experienced? How? Why? I don't understand any of this! We have to live it forever! Kill? What? What just happened? Everyone, we need to just calm down. First, let us take a second to summarize everything we just heard. Based on what Monokuma said, we essentially have two choices. Choice number one is that we stay here, in our communal life, together until the day we die. The other choice is... If we want to get out of here alive, we have to kill someone. But killing someone, that's... We're a big man of more and stuff in this place and men's work like a school. Oh, this is our each other. This is... This is just... This is... A lot. Yeah, that's, that's what it is. Oh, this ridiculous thing we've heard. This all has to be fake. Right now, it doesn't really matter if it's real or not. What matters is... Is there anyone here who is seriously considering all this? To that, no one has a response. Keep it quiet to myself. I look around at the others. Oh boy. They all scared of one another, trying to gain each other's thoughts. I can almost taste the hostility. That's when it hit me. I realized the true terror hitting within the rules my uncle had laid out. I must kill someone if you want to leave. Those words have created vicious thoughts deep within each other. Each of us being suspicious of everyone else, we forced to wonder if someone got a prey is. Oh no. This is gonna get kicked and off that the is how my new school life began. This school, which has come out of nowhere to raise my hopes so high, it's not a school of hope. It's a school of despair. Uh, All uh, credits. Da, da, da. Riggity, jaggity, jaggity, jaggity. Smackity, 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 smackity. Currently, diddly, there diddly, are 15 diddly, diddly, diddly. current students. Oh, oh man. Currently, students. To be continued! And then it plays the intro from the club. I can skip this if you want. Uh, I don't think the audience saw the intro, so fuck it! I'm pretty sure they did, but okay. Uh, uh nah. Oh wait, no, yeah, they did. I remember they did. Fuck it! Do you want me to skip it or no? Fuck you guys! Yes, no, what? Yes. Okay. 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 
got an item. The school crest has it? Yeah, we'll save. We finished the prologue, everyone. Yay! Now let's see who dies. Yes, kill some enemies on the eve. My main food is my gift card, my throat is a thought about that. I feel a paralyzed goose to be making my way through my body, dominating every last room. The air hung heavy on me, pressing down like a weight around my neck. Took everything I had to endure that weight. Chapter 1 To Survive Daily Life! <laughs> so, is every chapter someone's death, or. Every chapter is a daily life and a deadly life. Oh. Except for it's Where somebody died. Oscoy? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. For as heavy as the air felt, I took the tears it was with So, what are we going to do now? That's a good hey. question. Just standing around glaring at nothing? Or at each other? <laughs> Same thing? Well, yeah. Same thing. Good job. Tony Kelly was everyone in the room. Get up pull us back to reality. Right! She's right. Sometimes, even if you're nervous or afraid, you just have to step forward. To forget oh, Jesus, that that's simple face. fact, I can't forgive myself. I'm so ashamed. He looks like he just shit himself. Please, someone hit me. I can't forgive myself. Jeez. Someone hit me. Punish me! Punish me, Daddy! <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, we gotta just yell about it. You have, time. <laughs> you have time to do something about it. Well, well, brother, the Stupid. Idiot. To look for a way out. Duh. And we totally need to find whoever was controlling that stupid bear and beat the hell out of him. But before we do that, maybe we should take a look at the handbook? Probably best to check out the school regulations not to my mention before doing anything else. True. If you stumble around with no clue what the rules are, something like that might happen. Shit. Right. So then... <laughs> Fine, then let's hurry up and check out the stupid rules already. Rule one, everybody, suck my play. Rule two, <laughs> fuck off. Rule three, I am the Queen Day. <laughs> After turning on the e-book, or e-book, as the cool kids say, first thing I appeared is my name. So just like Monica people said, the only name can be a front and center. But if the main menu get popped up, I select a school regulation icon. Or Shadowman. An itemized list of students who are in the school vacations and then made some rules to impose on ourselves. Uh, here, actually, uh, I think it would be cool if. You know what, fuck it, I'm just gonna do it. Do it. Students may reside only within the school. Leaving campus is an unacceptable use of time. Nighttime is from 10 p.m. to 7 a.m. Some areas are off limits, so please exercise caution. Sleeping anywhere other than the dormitory will be. Seen as sleeping in class and punished accordingly. With minimal restrictions, you are free to explore Hope Peaks Academy at your discretion. Violence against Headmaster Monokuma is strictly prohibited, as is destruction of surveillance cameras. Anyone who kills a fellow student and becomes blackened will graduate unless they are discovered. It's cool. Additional school regulations may be added as necessary. Cool. <laughs> um, yeah, yeah, it's basically anime clue. He was naive with the dildo in the cafeteria. <laughs> Feeling a slight dizziness, I raised my face up from the screen. I looked around and saw the same throwing expressions on everyone's faces. This is bullshit. What kind of rules are these? I'm not gonna let them control me. Well then, why don't you wander around the school without a care in the world and see what happens? Personally, I would love to see what happens when someone breaks one of the rules. Oh, wow. What if we got punished like I ever saw before? I don't think I'll be able to lose for him while he's falling. Oh, no. Yeah. He's a gamer, too. Now he has to represent all of our Ever shit. since I was a kid, I grew up with my older brother pounding this into my head. When a man makes a promise, he has to keep it, even if it kills him. So what? I've made a ton of promises that I still have to keep. So that's why. Piece of shit. So I can't afford to die here. Piece of shit. None of that made much sense to me, but you are saying you will follow the regulations, okay? Uh-oh. Well, yeah, I guess you're right. That's true. Oh, wait, this is, uh... God <laughs> damn it! <laughs> Dumb Philly Burr. 
Uh, um, I have a question. Wait, 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 wait. number six. What is my complaint with this guy? Anyone, Anyone who kills a fellow student and becomes black and will graduate unless they are discovered. You're talking about the sick camp, right? When you say unless they are discovered. I was wondering about that, Mr. Hill. It's saying that if you want to graduate, you have to kill someone without anyone finding out it was you. It's fine, but it's I don't see any reason to worry about it. Just worry about following the rules as they've been explained to us. Mm -hmm. Frankly, I don't want to hear anything from someone who wants to do who waits for others to decide what's good for them. Give me a break. More like a full on stab. Don't you know? Let's forget all that silly junk about murders or whatever. I don't really know the rules. Let's just start exploring. True. We need to find out what exactly where exactly we are. Is there any way out? What's about food and supplies? There are tons of questions we need to answer. Damn straight. Okay, let's start all looking around. I'll be going along. What? Why? That's a pretty stupid idea, don't you think? Someone here might already have started thinking about murder. Are you saying we should stand around with them in our midst and make it? Yeah. And make it that much easier for them. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. <laughs> Fuck, how do I not know this? Wait, hold on a second. I would never. Don't bother saying it couldn't happen. You can't deny the possibility. That's why you all seized up without fear when the graduation rule was made clear to you. Am I wrong? Um. Fuck. Hmm. So I'm simply acting in accordance with what I think is best for me. Just hold on. Hold on, like hell I'm gonna like run off and do whatever you want. Out of my way, Plankton. Plankton! Plankton stealing me booty! The fuck's that supposed to mean? One tiny bit of plank dripping across the sea, trying to steal that damn Krabby Patty for me. So minuscule, so insignificant, they couldn't possibly have any kind of influence on the boundless ocean. I'm gonna kick your ass. Stop it. You can't even think. Fuck you, see? Some kind of goody goody little bitch. Oh, damn. Who do you think you are talking like that? You think you're my fucking dad or something? No, no I wasn't. wasn't your dad. Fuck you! Wham. I don't want to have issues. Fuck you. I'm gonna put back in the heat. Your legs up straight out of the comic book. <laughs> I didn't even see the punch coming. You just send me right there in my face. Second, I was sitting there next to Sony TV. Didn't think about it. Maybe I kind of forgotten. Kind of keep on track of your. My comment says it's just stop punch thing. Being around all these ultimates is really my fuses. Who gives a damn to be surprised and then says something as absurd as this? This is the last track to sad sense of reality. The last doubt is my consciousness starting to fade before I finally cut out completely. When I finally opened my eyes again, what I saw was boobs. Not yet. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> Where am I? As if I had become part of my daily routine, I woke up in the middle of the room and noticed the door. <laughs> okay, so where am I now? So yeah, we are now at this is our room. Do you wanna right. do you wanna look around? So yeah, like I, I guess this is like the actual start of the game. Some yeah. of our prologues. We're now doing we're now looking around and doing stuff. Where do you wanna look? Uh let's look let's look the windows, I guess. Alright. The first thing we see. You seem to have made a pleat now, do you? Yeah, no dip. No I can always dip. move around, too. Sure not. Um... So have you got something? No. Windows. We already, we already the checked the windows. <laughs> Surveillance camera. By the window. But you can't move, because if you do, then you die. It's a baby's camera. I hate the idea that someone might be watching us right now. We're not allowed to mess with the camera, so I better not be sure I touch them. Best. There doesn't seem to be anything particularly strange about this. Except for all these spikes spain, to shoot up in the black one here, but... <laughs> Alright, next thing. <laughs> uh, let's, let's go... Uh, what's that thing by the door to the right? What is that? This? No, no, not that. Like, this? in the middle. Like, yeah. between the door, the one door and the other door on the wall. This? Is that a TV? Oh, that. Yeah. Is that a TV? You got a manager. Yep. <laughs> oh, nice. Uh, I guess... 
go. Uh, well, yeah, what's that thing by the bed? What's that? What is that? Some kind of dildo? Too kind of eat, really. You get supposed to clean up after yourself? Alright, well. Um. Do we want to. Uh, wh what's on the table? This must be the key to the room. I'm entering now the keychain. Means this must be mine, right? My key. We'll hang on it for it for now. Okay, that's 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 good. That might be like a clue for later. Um, let's what's over there to the way right? right way that? right? Or I'm at the way left. Way Sorry, way I'm right? an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> this is no pad. Guess the rule must be given it to you. Oh. Uh what's the paper on the wall to the right? There you go. Ooh, this paper thing in the wall, which says, "Yeah, confirm headmaster man to that." Each room's lock has been designed to completely protect against tampering or lock picking. Remaking an individual room key is quite troublesome, so please make sure not to lose yours. Your room comes furnished with a shower, but please note that the water is turned off at nighttime. So, also, the bathrooms in the girls' rooms include a lock of their own. Finally, we've prepared a small gift for each of you. For the girls, a sewing kit. And for the boys, a toolkit. The sewing Gender kit norms. <laughs> Fuck this game. The sewing kit includes a map of the body's vital organs. One stab will do the job, girls. For the boys, we have believe a strong blow to the head with any of the tools should be ample. Don't think, just feel, and let's all enjoy ourselves. The crew put up the paper if you read the trash. Oh, Jesus. We should probably call it an episode. Yeah, I, I think. Oh, yeah, 22. Yeah. I think we're good with this. Yeah, well, uh, make sure you us. guys like, favorite, share... Comment, dibble, scribble. Love, love, love.